here's the mask, uh, the final chopper by DSS Studios, Dark Side Studios. This cost me $95 plus shipping. And I'm honestly, when I got this, I was really impressed how some some mask companies <clears throat> tots, can't do this level of quality. And they honestly, I'm still kind of shocked on how good it looks. The latex is thick, really thick latex. And he just put the artist that made him that made this thing, Paul Daniels. He just put a lot of care into detail. He glossed up the eyes. He he put acrylic teeth in and also glossed those. It just looks nasty. And I, I don't know what I would have done with my life without this. It's just so good. You also have the um, axe wound here. And uh, by the way, you should subscribe to Hippie Kid. He's the one that convinced me to buy a DSS mask. I watched all his videos and thought, hey, I'm gonna go check out this the guy Paul Daniels page. So yeah, you should go subscribe to Hippie Kid because he's the one that reviews these and gives a whole whole video about them. And really the detail is phenomenal. You he did multiple washes on it to get pick up all the detail. Oh, uh, you have little veins on it. The ears inside look nasty and gross. Honestly, really phenomenal job. I did request a slit in the back and a the eyes cut out and from without light you can't really tell that they're there and yeah now I'm gonna show you how it looks with the hawk here's how it looks with my hockey mask this is meant to look like part four so it's all damaged and smashed really it looks like Jason it looks like you chopped off Jason's head and you have it on a display case Honestly, with the hawk on, it is a little hard to see out of, just because you have these the hole, and then the smaller hole inside, and so I did have a little breathing, uh, trouble breathing through this mask, but honestly, I don't really mind that. So you should go pick this up. I believe it is eighty-five dollars now at dssstudios.com and everyone goodbye